When I started my business, it was the same mental approach of trying a lot of things in education to make my website take off and get 5,000, 7,000 hits a day. It's the same thing now with figuring out billionaires.com. It's trying hundreds and hundreds of combinations of what works, what doesn't work, experiments, A-B testing, and putting out a lot of potential ideas and irons in the fire to see what clicks. This strategy, brute force recipro reciprocation, I wanted to share with you um, because this has really changed my life. When I was in high school, I cold called everybody in the Yellow Pages that had a computer-related business. and I got a job doing uh, creating websites for local Indian-owned uh, Indian business owners in a local community, and that's how I learned to create websites. When I got out of college, everyone wanted to pay me thirty thousand dollars a year, so I cold called everybody in the Portland, Oregon Chamber of Commerce. Got hired as a risk consultant. And I made $100,000 my first year out of my undergrad, which was more than my professors were being paid by the university the year before, who told me, don't graduate a year early, take your time, enjoy school, suck it in. And I was impatient and wanted to get out of school. When I started my business, it was the same mental approach of trying a lot of things in education to make my website take off and get 5,000, 7,000 hits a day. It's the same thing now with figuring out billionaires.com. It's trying hundreds and hundreds of combinations of what works, what doesn't work, experiments, A-B testing, and putting out a lot of potential ideas and irons in the fire to see what clicks and what really resonates, and then doubling down on anything that really works. That's really been key to my success, and I see that in some other very successful people, like a Joe Williams, like a Mark Victor Hansen, who spoke on stage at our event last week, is the author and creator of the Chicken Soup for the Soul series. Um, as well as billionaires such as Jeff Hoffman or Richard Branson, etc. So for me, realizing this as a strategy, as a mental model, has helped me because now I lean in on that. And anytime I see a situation where I could approach it Grant Cardone style and take 30 different actions to make something happen or try five different approaches to getting something done at once, then it's massively helpful and everything goes much better. And I really think that luck is a four letter word for a reason. Um, it's really opportunity meeting hard work is why you get results. It, and it's nothing to do with luck.